Hello everyone. In today's class, let us learn about necessary and sufficient condition for an equation of the form m dx plus n dy equal to 0 to be exact differential equation of first order. Okay, let us learn necessary condition first. Let us consider the basic form which is m dx plus n dy equal to 0 which is a differential equation of first order. The condition for which m dx plus n dy equal to 0 is exact if it is expressible in the form m dx plus n dy equal to equal to derivative of u. Okay. Derivative of u. Let us consider this as equation 1 and this as equation 2 which is by the defi definition. Let us recall that if the given differential equation which is in the form m dx plus n dy equal to 0 can be expressed as derivative of some function of x and u, x and y, then we call that type of differential equation as exact differential equation. In our previous video, we learned what exact differential equation of first order is. Okay. Okay, let us derive this. As you know, the total differential equation of two variable is for the function u, okay, du equal to dou u by dou x into dx plus dou u by dou y into dy. Okay, which is the total differential equation. Call this as equation 3. Here, u is the function of x and y. Comparing this and equation 2. Okay, comparing equation 3 and equation 3. dx is there. The coefficient of dx is dou u by dou x and in the equation 2 we have coefficient of dx is m. So, m equal to dou u by dou x. Similarly, dy coefficient is dy coefficient is dou u by dou y and uh, in equation 2 it is the value of n. So, n equal to dou u by dou y. Differentiating, differentiating m partially with respect to y. we get dou m by dou y, right? m with respect to y. Let us substitute the value of m. dou by dou y of value of m is dou u by dou x. So, can be written as dou square u by dou y dou x, right? This can be written as dou square u by dou x dou y also. Can be written as dou by dou x of dou u by dou y. Right. Now, here, dou by dou x of dou u by dou y is nothing but n. So, so we got dou m by dou y equal to dou n by dou x, which is the necessary condition for the given differential equation to be exact. Very important. If the given differential equation to be exact, then it need to satisfy the condition dou m by dou y equal to dou n by dou x. Now, let us move towards sufficient condition. Suppose, suppose dou m by dou y equal to dou n by dou x. Suppose dou m by dou y equal to dou n by dou x. Let, let u be an integral of m u be an integral of m keeping keeping y constant so let us differentiate u partially with respect to x let us differentiate u partially with respect to x the term will be dou u by dou x right partially with respect to x u with respect to x but the value of dou u by dou x is m now let us differentiate this m partially with respect to y partially with respect to y so m that is dou m with respect to y 
equal to do by do y of here the value of m is do u by do x right so this is nothing but do square u by do y do x again we know that do m by do y is nothing but do n by do x we have already taken so let us substitute the value also that is we got do n by do x equal to do square u by do x do y now this can be written as do n by do x minus do square u by do y do y do y do x can be written as do x do by do y equal to 0 can be written as do by do x of n minus do u by do y we have already taken do x right equal to 0 now here n minus do u by do y with respect to x is 0 implies this is not the function of x whenever you got the derivative as 0 that implies the function is constant right with respect to x is 0 implies this should be the function of y because here this term is differentiated with respect to x not with respect to do is respected to y so whenever you are differentiating with respect to x then y will be taken as constant right so this is the function of y itself so i will consider n minus do u by do y as function of y function of y this can be written as n equal to f of y plus do u by do y now substitute the value of m and n value of m and n in the given equation one in the given equation one we get equation one says that m into dx the value of m is do u by do x into dx is there plus n into dy the value of n we got as f of y into oh sorry plus do u by do y right hmm, yes do u by do y into dy is the equal to zero now this will be do u by do x into dx plus f of y into dy plus do u by do y into dy equal to zero now let us uh, take this and this as one term then that will be do u by do x into dx plus do u by do y into dy plus f of y dy as it is equal to zero this is nothing but total differential equation d right du plus f of y dy equal to zero that is derivative of u plus f of y equal to zero derivative of some function equal to zero implies u plus f of y is a function of function of x and y thus thus m dx plus n dy can be written as derivative of y plus f of y right we got like that itself derivative of some function equal to 0 m dx plus n dy equal to 0 we can equate these two right so we got derivative of some function equal to 0 if we uh, can write m dx plus n dy equal to some function of x and y then this equation is exact differential equation okay this is the sufficient condition for a given exact differential equation is for a given differential equation is exact okay let us solve um, problems in our next class working rule as well as problem okay